Hey, good morning, good evening, good afternoon, everybody. Today I want to stress the importance of getting information out there that is accurate and meaningful. If you are going to be helping people with their gameplay, their graphics, their computer, their car, you know, it doesn't matter what it is. If you're helping somebody out, you should have accurate information and explain what you're doing and why you're doing it. That's what people want to know. They want to know what to do and why they're doing what they're doing. All right. So I have a really helpful Discord here. If you're having any issues with anything, you can come to the error fix videos. You can go to the CSP section. There's everything here that you need. Okay. And anybody that knows me and follows my content and gets help will know that this video here is just a complete shot in the dark chance of trying to fix something and as this guy goes through the video he just says enable 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 disable 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 and turns off things like having the ability to use your number keys for binds to turn your boost up and down which doesn't affect anything at all for your CPU and, and your gameplay and then we got all these optimizations in the general patch settings of CSP this guy is changing when these depend 100% on your system. This isn't the same for everybody. It's a wide variety of different things. And you can't just go in here and tell people to change everything and hope for a magical fix. If you really want to fix your 99% CPU problem, it's not because of a couple random little things in here that are actually going to fix your CPU being used too much because that's not how it works. That's not how any game works. You have to do some steps accurately and properly to actually get this game to run really well in the bigger servers. So if you are getting 99% CPU occupancy, this is the fix that you need to do that will not only fix Assetto, but will also help you with every other game that you play and running on your PC as a whole. So the first thing you want to do is you want to go to PC optimizations in my Discord. And as you follow these, you'll see sections like online lag spikes, issues loading into servers, common Windows optimizations, deleting old game files and useless old apps, check Windows files, remove virus and malware. These are the things that are going to help you with your CPU on your computer as a whole entire whole of a system without hoping that some random video on YouTube that told you to change a couple random settings is going to help. Because if you go to that video and this works for you because of your system and it doesn't work for 8 out of 10 other people, then that's not really helping anybody. That's causing more problems in the community by giving out information that might not be totally correct and true. So that's a problem and that's why we're here today is to realize that I've spent enough time here and I've done enough for you guys that you really don't need to rely on any sort of random videos. If we go to my my channel here and I just go to my YouTube studio real quick and I go to my analytics you'll see here that I have all of these videos that are popular. All of these videos are useful these videos have tens of thousands of views up to 100,000 views almost 200,000 these are the videos that you need for a set of Corsa these are how you are going to get your PC and your game running good and if you need to fix things there's an error fix video section if you need CSP settings if you need VR settings if you're just looking for some helpful keybinds or some light configs there's all of that stuff here too so what I'm saying is, at the end of the day, I have spent so much time and effort on multiple different systems that I've owned playing this game, and I have gone so far into the settings that, not to toot my own horn, but I know so much about the integrity of these settings and how important it is to know what you're changing and what it's doing. So if you need any help, if you need to know what these settings are, Please check out some of my videos, some of my older videos, explaining how to get more FPS, explaining how to fix CPU, explaining race cancelled, explaining checksums. These errors haven't changed. They're still going to be the same process to fix all of these errors that you have. And that's where I come into play, is 
reliable information regardless of your system you'll get the information from me I'll be telling you that integrated graphics needs to do this these low-end GPUs can do this high-end this <coughs> and uh, that's pretty much it I just uh, seen that today going on and uh, you know I watched the guy's video and let's just say I'm not gonna be using that I wouldn't recommend anybody to use that and uh, you know it is what it is man it's just one of those things where you're not gonna fix 99% CPU for everybody by switching around a couple things in one setting section of CSP it's never worked that way it will never work that way and it's going to continue to not work that way you really have to put an effort and really try some of this this stuff here and you really have to put your time into it right if you're gonna go take a nice car out on the mountain roads on a weekend with your buddies and everything you're not going to be sitting there and hoping that your car doesn't break you're probably going to go over your whole car tighten all the bolts check your brakes check your fluids check your oil maybe you go on a road trip you do your oil change these things take hours of time to make sure that your car is going to be reliable and provide you the best driver's experience while you're driving it you need to do the same thing with Assetto and your computer and you need to spend a couple hours going through all of these things tuning your PC, getting it refreshed, getting those bolts tightened up if you will, and making your PC reliable and safe to give you the best driving experience you can get. Have a good day everybody, take care, stay gaming.